Well, my people, there is just the news that the Daniela, who happens to be the first daughter to Yul Edoche, blocked him online, of which immediately after she did that, the mother was forced to come and respond to the other post that Yul posted the other day of marrying Judy Austin being a blessing to his first wife. And these are the words of May. He posted, and I write, and I read, waking up daily to the love and support I find here gets me going. I'm a constant journey of self-discovery. It sometimes takes unprecedented situations to discover our true abilities and how we can utilize them in unimaginable ways. I have always been behind the scenes as a wife, entrepreneur, a backbone, a midfielder, a superhero, a prayer warrior, and more, working tirelessly, resiliently, and dedicated to building a peaceful, successful home. God alone blesses the works of our hands in his own time. My determination slash drive and the course of my, okay, my determination slash drive and of course the support I get from you all have been the driving force behind my recent achievements, the encouragement from you all, my family and from all over the world inspires and motivates me to keep thriving. Sometimes you think you're buried but you have just been planted. Always stay true to yourself and do not compromise your core values and your beliefs regardless of the pressure. So those are exact May words on her post and she decided to come out and respond because the other day apparently Odogu Yul Edoche decided to come and post that marrying Judy was the best thing that ever happened to their family because it's because of marrying Judy that now the wife, the first wife, May Edoche, got her first endorsement ever, something that she has never done before. So guys, I just want you to see what I am seeing. What I'm seeing from this video is that Yul will never stop rubbing this thing to May's face. It's high time they should just let this lady be. I mean, she has tried and now she's trying to make something out of her life. She's trying to pick up the left pieces. She's trying to move forward, but they won't just let her go. What is that? Yul Edoche and Judy Austin, what is that? There's nothing as annoying as someone coming and telling you that your own achievements are related to somebody who you consider an enemy in your life. That is the worst thing that can ever happen to any woman. And she came to say it true, that it's only God that blesses the work of our hands. It is nothing like the husband getting married. If God wanted to bless this lady, even if the husband didn't marry, he would have still blessed this lady. My goodness, guys, we need to all keep praying for May Yul Edoche because she really needs all of us right now. And as you can see on the write-up, she posted that our support all of us all over the world is what keeps her going, is what keeps her motivated and keeps her getting uh, thriving. So please, guys, let's pray for her. And as for Judy Austin and Yule Doche, it's only God that will judge all of you because I really can't know what you people want anymore. I don't know why you can't allow this lady to rest. I don't know why you feel you should link her success to your new marriage. I really don't understand what is the meaning of all this. And now, Yule has just decided to use Judy Austin to break his home. Imagine his own daughter. He's first daughter Danielle just deciding to block him on the whatsapp social media and just because of this woman and because she too she's growing up she's a grown-up lady she has graduated just recently and she knows when her mother is being hurt and there's nothing that really affects the children in their mental health than seeing that their parents are not in good terms it really really does affect them so if you knows what is good for him let him just lie low for now and keep off social media this is my opinion though you can comment on your own down below let me know let me know what you think do you feel that you should just lie low for now and stop posting stop reacting stop coming back outside to be talking what i don't know and just let this lady be and also stop rubbing it off this lady's face that is now married to a new woman because don't forget that the devil you know is better than the angel you don't know and the woman of your youth is the one that stood by you 
you when you had nothing and when the ones you marry when you have everything when everything disappears they disappear with it is the one that came when you had nothing that will stand by you until the end of it all so if it's good for him, let him just lie low for now and let peace reign. Let everybody just try to forget this saga because I can't imagine the pain the children are going through, waking up every morning with new sagas, new bug bows about their parents on social media. It's very, very painful. I can't just, I, in fact, I don't even want to imagine. I don't want to relate because we can't say we can relate. We can't relate because it's only the person that is wearing the shoe that knows where the shoe actually pinches the most. This May is an epitome of beauty. She says she has been at the background as the prayer warrior. She has been trying to make a peaceful home, but now just like Queen Wokoe said the other day on her post, just one moth in the palace will just come and destroy everything that you have fought for. Everything that you and me have been trying to build, to make beautiful in this life. Over the years they have been together. All of a sudden, everything is crumbling. Why? Just because of one person. One person that has made it very clear on a post on TikTok that she's after Yul's presidential seat and money. Comment down below, let me know what you think. I'll see you guys in my next.